Greetings fellow Decepticons, Sound Blaster 1987 here with part 4 of my undersized Mini Force Penta X Tron knockoffs. Today I'll be covering Sammy, the Red Ranger of the team, in his uh, giant helicopter gunship robot. Very reminiscent in both his transformation and its design in this mode of animated Megatron, specifically his leader class Earthmo toy, except he's got one set of rotors on there, nah, the main part of it. Back of the, yeah, helicopter mode. If it were to be truly accurate to animate a Megatron, the blade would be split onto the wings like so. But I digress. Put these wings back together. Plug him in here again for a moment. So, for size comparison, here he is with Volt's little man, compact SUV Humvee type vehicle. I'll cover Vault in the next video. So, to transform Sammy into robot mode, first leave the helicopter rotors where they are because they might as well just stay there for now. So, lift up these little winglets to the side here, like so. Fold out the arms and extend them. Gently pull to extend the knee joints and split the legs like so. Make sure the arms are both fully out of the way like so. Then remove the arm cannon like so. And much like animated Megatron, it pegs onto the right arm like so. Then finally, dislodge the canopy and bring your nail into this sliding tab here to bring the head up, which uh, obviously due to the quality control of this Chinese undersized knockoff is not going to be easy, so bear with me on this one. is again due to the Chinese quality control. Once the head's up it doesn't want to stay up so bear with me if it slips again. And here we have the Sammy Bot whoops, in his robot mode. For articulation in this mode if the head was able to stay up long enough Unfortunately, there's no head movement on this figure because of the way the slider mechanism works from the neck. These shoulder panels can move up and down a little bit. Bicep swivel. Bicep curler elbows with no way to keep them the right way round. Wrist rotation as well. Then ratcheted. I mean, yeah, they would be ratcheted on the original Korean release, but this is the Chinese knockoff, so these are just friction hinges for the up and down shoulders, so you can have him aiming his Megatron style fusion cannon forward like so. Then a pretty wide hip joint like so, which can also ratchet forward and back. There would be a knee joint underneath this slider mechanism on the Korean figure, but this is a Chinese knockoff, so again, that's been simplified. Nothing of a feet either due to the transformation. So, for size comparison, as you can see, this is the size comparison between Sammy and Vault in their robot modes, and for size comparison, once again, This is how big the undersized knockoff Penta Extron combiner will be. Minus the arms, of course, because these two become the arms. So watch out for part six of my review when I complete this combiner. So that concludes my review of the Sammy Bot. I have been Sandblaster1987. Join me again next time for part five when I'll be reviewing the Vault Bot. Till then, till all are one.